Hey guys, Cam here from today's iPhone.com and I have the Moshi Versa cover for iPad Mini. Moshi is obviously a brand that's well renowned for making iPhone and iPad cases as well as MacBook cases and PC stuff and they make a whole range of accessories. Now this is the Versa cover. It's slightly unique in that it's basically the same as the Origami case by um, Incase uh, with a slightly different design. But I'm going to unbox it and show you it. See if I can get this open quickly. Printed with soy ink, that's so nice to know. Does that make it edible, I wonder? So it says sample only, not for sale, so I guess this won't be going on eBay. Let's just open this. All the packaging is very, very cardboardy and plastic, so um, easily recyclable. Uh, inside here we have a piece of cardboard, and that's about it. Um, I've not used the Versa cover before, so it'll be interesting to see what this is like. You see the rear shell is just transparent. It's kind of got this frosty finish, so it's not completely transparent. Translucent, rather. Uh, you can see the brand name is here, Versa cover. That doesn't come off, I don't believe. And the Moshi logo on the back there. And that, if you can see the patterns on the front cover, that's because it's been designed to fold up like so. I'll show you when the iPad's in it. Let's get the iPad in. Uh, these cost $50 by the way, and they are available from store.moshimondi.com. I will put a link as always in the description box. Let's just clip that in there. $50 like I said, but they're available in four different colours. This is the green, uh, aloe green, there's a pink and a brown and a blue, denim blue, available as well. It's got these magnetic, um, it's magnetic so it will auto wake your iPad when you open it up. And you can see if you fold it in a variety of different ways you can get various different angles. I mean, it's got quite a few segments in here, so I'm gonna to have to figure out how exactly this is supposed to go. There we go. You can see that's kind of your viewing angle. It's folded up like so. So that's it folded up into a pyramid, and you can use that for all sorts of angles. For instance, you can fold it back this way and have your iPad at a good reading angle. Uh, I believe that's right, or is it that way? That feels a bit more sturdy. So you fold it all the way back so it's resting on the back part of the iPad uh, and then you have it at a portrait angle resting nicely or you can put it that way to view your videos or you can have it this way to have it at a more comfortable, a slightly narrower angle. Uh, if you want to use it for typing you can use it like this too. You can see it's very sturdy. So it's a pretty versatile case, certainly a lot more versatile than your standard smart cover which just rolls back and gives you either up, upwards or typing. So nice case, it feels like it's a good quality material. On the inside it's all microfiber lined so it should keep most grime and fingerprints etc off your iPad screen. Um, and it does feel nice and soft in hand and it should give you adequate protection. Obviously not Otterbox style, but that's not what you want if you're buying one of these. Very, very slim indeed. I'll show you the profile of the case if I just zoom in. Like so, you can see it's a very, very slim case. Hardly adds any bulk at all, which is what exactly what you want from your iPad mini. You can see it's got this neat pattern on the front cover. Anyway, like I said, they're $50 from the Moshi store. I will leave a link, as I've already said, and you can follow me on Twitter, ask me any questions about this, or any other cases, or iPads, or whatever. Um, I'm at TIP underscore Cam, and I will see you again soon.